How's it going, everybody? Tim with LCB. The last break of Rookie P9. We're on 425. The PYT. This is the last one. 424 video is up. Uh, 426 broke before 425. That was a random teams. That video is being uploaded right now. And here's the last one. I just gotta switch this up in the background because there's no way I'm gonna listen to that awful, awfulness. Put ESPN on or something. Highly questionable is on. Perfect. I don't even know if anybody can hear that. That is very, very low right now. Yeah, and I got copyright strikes from last night, Matt. Ugh, I really hate YouTube. It's really just getting depressing. Soon, I, I keep saying this, but soon we'll have the Facebook stream up. So we can actually have real music. It'll just be, it'll be glorious. Be like the good old days. Ah, uh, yeah, but that music I used last night, I got a bunch of copyright strikes, and they took down some of the videos. Who knows? Alright. Good luck, everybody! 425? Let's get into it. Who cares about the order? Let's just go for it. <laughs> I'm sure Hag's in the chat somewhere. Good old Hag. We gave him a new Viking name. Haig Valla? Haig Valhalla? We'll still end it with those four, but we'll mix up the order here. Get all the plastics off first. Ben, going for those Mets. Maybe your Pete Alonzo's hiding right in here. Autographed rookie chrome. Top Chrome, we go back to Update Hobby in this format. Go ahead and take the pack right out of the Sterling. Put it right there. First time ever trying the Mets. Started with Optic in this case. And then Chrome, and then Bowman. Sounds good to me. And one Optic Hot Box tonight with a colored Hot Box. Still think we're due for another one. We had an autograph Hot Box the week prior. Like I was told, Crowder cleared that up. I couldn't remember what it was. Four per case. I definitely should have another one soon. Not happening here though. Could be an autograph one. A sweet Oriole Super worth nine bucks. I'll tell you what. I pull you an Oriole Super. No matter what, I'll buy it for 18 bucks. I don't care who it is. I don't care if it's an Oriole Super out of 2012 draft of a kid that was drafted in the 50th round and never made the bigs. I will double your nine dollar evaluation. All of this is probably for not, but we'll see what happens. We ran out of 19 Bowman, and it's getting incredibly hard to restock. I am hoping to have it back in a week when I make a new new breakdown. Well, we will have it back. So, we'll have it back. It's just uh, getting tougher to find, man. Oh, I figured you did. I figured he did not. That's what most guys do. They grab some cheap teams if they're near the top of the board. The Orioles actually do tend to hit a lot of color. You know who hits a lot of color, though? The Oakland A's. I feel like every week, and I guess this week's not a great example because I think they only have one or two. Oakland A's always seem to land the color. Why is ESPN so low? Volume wise. But you get it off in plenty of time to let the opponent get a shot off. Now, there we go. go. That is 18 Bowman, you see. Yep. <laughs> so, yeah, Crowder, I didn't, I didn't take it out. We just 
we ran out. We went through about four cases over the last couple weeks. Gotta find more now. Here we go. Optic. Noah Syndergaard. Really, Brad? See, I feel like you're one of the guys that studies the uh, breakdown every week. And then chooses his teams accordingly. I mean, the breakdown only changes every two weeks. I do six breaks the same every time I do them. Hoskins, red, numbered out of 60. So the Phillies score first. Braulio, little one-point card. Breaks the tie for second. Absolutely. Uh, well, ComC is really easy, to be honest with you, Matt. Um, it's a consignment site. You send your stuff to them. They list it. They add it into your virtual port, which you then log into. You can see images of all your cards. You see them all scanned. And then you simply set your prices. And you really don't need to do much research because probably 90% of the cards already have a market on there where you can see the high and the low. So you can just price them in the middle, price them at the high, price them at the low, whatever you want to do. Ichiro, little Prism MVP. I mean, that's the, the simple explanation. There are a couple ins and outs that I can teach you once you get set up on there. But basically, that's it. We got an orange. Mad Bum for the Giants out of 99. One point card. San Fran, Brett B. Are you intrigued? Brett B up to nine. MVP Joey Votto. We have no ink yet. There's the first one. Toronto Blue Jays. Very nice orange. Danny Jansen, rated rookie ink for the Toronto Blue Jays. Shannon, that's all you. <coughs> 42 out of 99 on the Danny Jansen. Frambler Valdez, Kopech and Marquez. We got Bregman. Snell and Bodie, Illusions Yelich, Altuve and Taylor Ward. Should be one more graph in the bottom here, and there it is. It's a Kopech for the White Sox. There we go. Yeah, you don't want to be that guy. I always just try to match the low instead of undercutting the low. Essentially, ComC is a giant stock market for cards, though. That's really, like, the most generalized explanation for it. Rendon out of 50 for the Nationals. Three scoring cards out of Optic. That doesn't happen every week. Nationals, Eddie G. Hopefully he re-signs with you guys. I feel like he belongs there. Two-point card for you, Eddie. Are you on the board? You are now. A studio, Joey G, Alec Baum, and Jake Bauer. Okay, let's get in some packs here. Then we'll go top scroll. This is our 19 Sterling min 19 Sterling mini box. Damn, gold. Gold. Is that the auto? That is the auto. Ian Anderson. That is exactly who you hear, Stephen. I can't. I don't know why it's not louder. I don't want total dead air. Here, I'll turn it up that way. Is that better? Loud enough so you can hear it, but not drowning me out. Riley Duggar. Nolan Jones. Nice auto. Connor Scott. Hitting prospect for the Marlins. 15 out of 50. Chadwick. Four-point card, too, on the Connor Scott gold. Chad with some points. Moving on up to 13. Next time we're fifth place. She's gonna have to deal with me. Coming for you, Steve. All right, let's do our drafts. 12 draft has just been abysmal tonight, but again, these are $10 packs, so they're really just tossings. Chubb, Addison Reed, AJ Pollock, rookie. There's a nice one. Bauer outage. Forgot he was in this. This is official Chrome rookie right there, Trevor Brown. Yeah, it is, honestly, it's great for lower-end stuff. It's not great for high-end. Mid-end, mixed results on there. That sucks. That's annoying that they would do that. they got to understand, they're hurting everybody when they do that. Iwakuma, rookie, and Christian Frederick. David Dahl, first Bowman, Parker Morin, and... It's kind of stuck here. See, I'm intrigued. You going to watch that with your mom tonight? Jeffrey Wendelkin and Hunter Scantling. Like 
12 draft. That's all the time we have for today. Nothing for much. Watching. Diana, do you have anything to plug? Yeah, the best pregame show in America. True. Yep. Yeah. LaVarn Way. Furbush. Israel, anything to plug? Albuquerque. <laughs> Harrison. <laughs> Tyler Godell. Is Josh Parr. Nice <laughs> card. George Springer. First Bowman. <laughs> Couple bucks. <laughs> nice Astros hit. Jaron. You'll see that in your Com C port someday. Eric Hop right up for you to Can price. We talk about Eric for a second? Eric Johnny Bledsoe. Giovatella, last so chance at a trout rookie. He just had to go without him not getting a chrome. Vinny Pistana. That should be legal. Larry Green. Does he not? He, I, I think he thinks he's getting away with it. What's worse? Clifton, JJ there Hicks, and Joe Demers. So the 11 and 12 draft. Here's our bat. Meh, I say. 15 draft Super J. So far tonight, we have hit perfect on the odds for this. One in every two. Let's see if it continues. Walker Bueller first chrome. The inbounds got all the attention. Sky blue the Casey Houston. No so we're gonna it's all start paper here. there. Bledsoe got the offensive foul call on Lou Williams here in the fourth quarter. Medina, Hermelian, nice Willie Calhoun. Spencer Adams, Adams, we do have an auto. Bradley Zimmer. Eric Jenkins for the Texas Rangers. I'm going to guess he's one of the ones that is not panned out. Texas Jaron. That was awful. And, uh, Tyrone like Taylor and Preston right. Morrison. Uh, I, I said it up front. Now I like it even less. Bill, does Josh have a point here? Does the NBA have a clue here on how to officiate these challenges? Doc has a perfect There's point there. Chrome. He says, Nobody wants to be Sky wrong. Sky blue Kyle right. Wilcox. Nobody have known on the chrome. To the paper. But only 24% in the fourth <laughs> quarter. 50% in the first quarter. So I did hear something about that. The Is it true? Die cut for the Tigers. We've got Cronworth. And we did get a second auto, too. Brian Mondell. Lucas Herbert for the Braves, so we beat the odds here. Fortunately, that means there's going to be a break with no autos out of the Super J. Atlanta Braves, Shannon. Lucas Herbert. David Thompson, 499. 18 Super J. We also need to try to find some more 16 draft Super Jumbo. Is not a foul. When they go home tonight, when they're in the airport talking to each other, they're going to know that, hey, if I like to take the pickup game, this wouldn't be a foul. It's just really frustrating. I also think okay, 18 sort of drafts got this giant stack of paper on the top. Game about officiating. If you don't win a challenge, well, you're and allowed the to argue, right? Because you Same thing on each side. The court. I think Doc is within his rights. It's a Mata 150 for the Sox. Where that would have been a fine, right? Because you'd be questioning the officiating. Yeah. But the challenge is literally questioning Bottom the officiating. Bottom stack there. Kevin Black and right, going the right through the chromes there's going to be one auto not sure which side it'll be on if it's on this side it's going to be purple it looks like Denneberg swaggerty ryan rollison that's a beautiful looking card 81 out of 250 colorado brian j bo bichette johnson mckay and lolo sanchez uh, you know, that has Ink will be over here. Doesn't look numbered. Looks like a refractor. Tristan Cassis. Schnell. Alec Baum. That is a variation auto. Damn, that is nice. I was going to say, I saw Alec Baum, but it didn't look like his first auto. So the variation autos numbered out of 99, and they look like refractors. 65 out of 99. The Phillies. Braulio, very nice hit there, man. Big time prospect for Philly. Be playing next to Harper in a few years. Maybe next year. Nice card. And two points. Braulio needed those, too. Phillies, yep. 19. Creeping up on Dave T. Merker, Mitchell, Naylor, Joey Wentz on the bottom. Tops Chrome Jumbo. The NBA referees, get over it, boys. You're going to have to get used to this. Top Scrum Jumbo autos tonight have been absolutely abysmal. We're due. Let's go. Dropping bombs. That needs to be on shirt if he makes it to the bigs and hits some. Daywell Lugo, Prism, Judge, and Stanton. That happens as well, Bill Plasky. 
Yeah, but I think we're seeing it. We see it in the NFL too with the passing. Kyle Tucker, the rookie. Referees, the officials don't want it. Degrom. Hey, it's a good start, Loriano, rookie. Base for the A's. Jaron, all you on the buy out there at the end. Next card. Reviews opened up everything. He'll be better next year. Chapman and Anders. One auto out of the Chrome. We got four more fine. Prism Will Myers, uh, Flash Chance Adams. People are forgetting about Kawhi Leonard is he has a disease of the tendon. Okay, it's not Five teams, zero points. Man, let's go. Tatis rookie. We got a Votto. Pujols. Another solid auto. Kid was leading the NL in batting average when he got hurt. Hit 339 or something crazy like that. May not have been leading, but he was up there. I think he was. Ben, it's not Alonzo. Nice card. Jeff McNeil, rookie auto. You don't need to inbound the ball anymore. Should be I mean, back nice and strong no, next year. There's a Loriano uh, Chrome rookie, too. Look, what's Bob Ryan, right, please, please. Bob? I want to hear this, Bob. <laughs> Why not? I mean, Bill. No. Gurriel, mean, future like, stars. Like, we got a Danny Jansen and an Urias. Ludicrous. You know, can, if you guard him, you have to be an important play. Larry Bird steals the ball from the. Uh, exactly. Oh, Larry Bird steals Full the ball. Flash, hold on. Eat this Lindor, first. Tucker, Flash. Hey, and DJ Maybe Steve. Not every possession, but down the stretch, it's very important. You want to take that out of the game? Sorry. Oh, you're taking yourself out of the game right now. We'll move on. No, it's in the game. Virginia 48, Syracuse 34. Crawford. Yeah, we got a blue auto coming up. 34 of all the ways to start a season. That's one of them. Jeffrey Springs. Was Jim Beheim happy about this? Syracuse only scored no, 34 points last night. I completely missed this. that. It's Yo, stupid. It's just a money grab. They got scheduled games for TV. Wow, he came right out and said that. I completely missed his conference. That is epic. Uh, sorry, 142 out of 150, Jeffrey Springs. I just don't think it's Texas for Jaron. smart. I was mesmerized by uh, the classic Jimmy Beheim post game rant. He's right, though. I think it's incredibly dumb to start conference play right off the bat. Incredibly dumb. Especially for a team like Cuse that is almost always a slow starter. Taiwan Walker, 299 for the D-backs. Tukey and Urania. I love that he speaks his mind. 19, only 15 in the second half. I thought you guys had some good recruits this year, bro. That is a nice Vladdy. Shannon, beautiful little refractor there for you. Vladdy G. Newman and Nick Shufo. There's the Newman Hyper, or Prism. Three autos, we got one left. Four autos. Four autos, one left. It's been a better box. Got some better names. McNeil and Loriano. Still need a top-tier name here. It'd be nice. Another Vlad rookie. Two in the box. Nice Tucker refractor. Kikuchi. O'Hearn. McNeil. Sevy. He utterly and thoroughly had the point, Bob. You know, the ACC Crowder, yeah. A bunch of them, man. It's stupid. So now Cuse is 0 1 in the ACC. They get to go to play. They got to go play all their non conference games. And then when they start the ACC regular play, already 0 1. Nice Tatis. Great box for rookies. Two Vlads, two Tuckers, two Tatises, one Prism. Yep. Every team except for Duke. But I mean. What are we complaining it's about? It's definitely not any favoritism with Duke. We had to play <laughs> we had to play Kansas, so Francisco Arcia. I mean it's a game. Fletcher and Springer. It really is a money grab though. It's because they're pushing the ACC network crowder. That's the big thing with it. They want people to download the app, use it, watch the games on there. Evan Longoria for the Giants out of 99 got some points. Brett B, one point for Brett. Catch up to double digits, buddy. 10. McGuire and Herrera. Next box we go. 18 Bowman. Have not seen a colored auto out of the Bowman yet. Should definitely be a couple. Maybe a blue, a perp, maybe a gold or an orange. I think oranges were uh, hobby only. Update box up next, and then we got our finale with Chrome. In leash.
Eloy, first auto right off the bat. It's a nice one. Mackenzie Gore. Short print, too. Brian J. Nice hit, man. This was his SP second auto. Hardly ever see this card. Pretty nice score, dude. Nice card, Brian. I know you PC him, too. Nice hit. Yep. They went up from 18 to 20, yep. Two games per team need to be before Christmas. Nice. Gutierrez, how about you? So Cuse plays I mean, at Georgia Tech. Well, wow. they should be able to get a win there. NFL, you ever heard of in the Who are the new recruits on Cuse, Craig? Game, still going to be in it. it's, it's the trick of the league. So everybody's in it I usually study up on Cuse because I get to watch him play a bunch of bunch of can teams early in the season. I mean, they don't even need Philip Rivers saving them the last couple of games. He's Wasn't able to watch that one, obviously, the same night as the uh, Duke game. Jen Hosang at a 150. Um, and, and, you know, you've got a car on the other hand. And Cubbies. That offense has been very, very good. If you look Santana, at car, Reagans, and Alonzo. He's been really good, and that's the one thing we There you go, Richard. Got a Jen Hosang blue rookie. It's been shown. Numbered out of 150. We got your one card, at least. Everyone's still in it. Certainly not in Miami and Washington, D.C. This is really but weird. Freaking ACC, man. Teams, a loss is not going to bury either. You don't think. For the rest of the year. Kyle Cody, 499, light blue. They're still in the playoff hunt. They'll be four and six, KB. Uh, yeah, absolutely. I still think they can look at their schedule, which is what I did. They've got some cupcakes coming up in the next few weeks. <laughs> they can still <laughs> rebound and get their commitment to. And that's not their next couple games. That's that's a few down the road. And they can play the Chiefs. And who knows what the Chiefs are going to look like. We've questioned Tatis them. and Leody. We got a well, Kevin so Newman, Aqua, 125. And Bob Ryan, how about you? I imagine if it's successful for the ACC, the, all the other conferences, including your, your Pac-12, I'd have to think they'd probably fall asleep. I personally don't even have the ACC network installed yet. I need to get it installed. Calquan Trail trending. Bowman birthdays. Luke Weaver. Nothing much there. Andres Jimenez. If they win, they're like, they could be a to win. Would you say, Bob, the Raiders have exceeded expectations as much as the Chargers have? Quincy Guerrero, Joe Girard. Well, the Raiders Rice are the team good the in. Of that. Jesse Plus, Edwards. You are your says New you Jersey are. and That's Africa. They're better than what you guys got a ton of new are. recruits this year. Hayes and Nick Williams, little Braves pipeline there. Nice Luis Robert. That's his first Bowman. Big card there. Brian J. Next year, that thing should pop. You did say something earlier this week about the Chargers and London. Right. Still two and autos in the 18 Bowman. I was full of scoff, but now it seems like there's at least some traction there. The Kyber, London Chance, Universal Harrison Bader, second auto, Chargers Sam Hilliard. So Bill Blaschke, <laughs> Colorado <laughs> Rockies, we'll Brian. Here, Brian. Thank you. Thank you. It's like your column got that conversation going. Young, Peters, yeah, and Rowdy. Dean Spanos doesn't exactly... Around the Horn is brought to you by Dominic. Order online and track your order. <laughs> you are in the lead, buddy. The video is up, Dave. You can watch the recap at the end. Eric Lauer out of 250. 161, 250. Padres. Brian J. This is the last one of the night. This is the pick your team. As you can see on the screen. 425. Senzel Jimenez, we got a Francisco Mejia. Boy, Mejia really like, God, he got traded to the Padres and just off the board, right? Robles, and there's our last auto. Oh my God. I mean, come on, Corbin, haunting us tonight. Absolutely haunting us. The Brew Crew is Brawlio. That's all you, man. That Corbin, that sweet, sweet Corbin Burns, CB. Unbelievable, this guy. Josh Lowe, Shed Long, Zoich, and Tatis. That Tatis. 46. They wouldn't put a chrome variation down there, no. That's just his umpteenth chrome. Seriously. Other than Otani, there have not been many booms. There were a couple from the Valiant boxes. Leaf boxes, I mean. The Alonzo out of five was gorgeous. 
Prado White, Boz, Trammell, and Flaherty. Isabel, Kai Boom, and Garcia. Let's get update done. There's our black pack slash silver pack. So far, we have had one image variation per box tonight. One out of the first hobby, one out of the second jumbo. My box picking was not on display tonight. Okay, here we go. Nice Eloy rookie. BGO debut. Hunter Pence, that's not a variation we've checked. Thurman Munson. Martin Maldonado. Trevor Story. There's a Pete rookie. First one. Verlander, Steel City, nice Thyro Estrada Black. That should be numbered out of 299. Yankees rookie on the 84 design. Jaron, all you. No numbers though. Or no points, I mean. Dal Acuna, Matt Dubidi. There's a Willie Mays on the 84. Craig Kimbrell was the 150th gold stamp there. <clears throat> Lane Thomas and Bishop. Jeff McNeil, Family Business Vlad. Not the numbered ones, though. Nice looking card. Joey G. There's a Shavis rookie there. And one stack remains an update. There's a true BGO rookie. Trent Thornton. We got a gold. Wade Miley. Houston. Carter. Didn't notice that was his true first. Vito Brad Hand. We got a foil for the Mariners. Vladdy, home run derby Coming rookie. To you from the Seaport District at Pier 17. Seaport District, Tier 17. That's a nice Nelson Cruz. The original thought for me to do the handlebars, I was undefeated before Sunday with the handlebar mustache, so I shaved it off. Oh, one oh. Okay, Never mind. Thank you, Baker Mayfield. So Naylor just looked different, I think, because it was upside down. There was also some nice Tatis. Game Brian J. Well, Tatis rookie debut with RC. Beckham some touches earlier in the game so he's he's questioning his look and maybe Clemens iconic team, Carter and a Nikki Sunzel on the bottom mustache you need a certain razzmatazz hello hello he doesn't have that hello oh, oh, okay Stop. all right Holiday, uh, hold on a second hold on a second does Bill Plaschke have the hello hello let's go to the national panel thumbs up or thumbs down Humbly the Contreras and Springer I'm a fan of old timey voice I'll give you points but the ruling stands with the national panel Israel you're just as yeah, let's everyone just damn Cole hey, Tucker so on fire tonight at LCB. That's a nice car. Way. That's a big That's rookie. A he ever blows up in Pittsburgh. 52 out of 67. Odell, Very rare. Update rookie for Cole Tucker. Pirates this break again. Chad. Nice one, man. Out of 67. Looks sharp, too. One point for you in the points tournament. You're up to 14 now. Or criticizing himself Gutierrez, Real Muto, and Luis Sessa. I hear that as him criticizing the coach, basically, because again, he is Odell. You should be able to get him the ball, and frankly, you should be able to get him the ball. 84 on the Goldie. You want to. The fact More that he's base. not getting it, especially in the red zone, is trouble. JB. Well, I'll I'll uh, sell that part about the the, uh, the handlebar mustache. I mean, look, you shouldn't even be shaving during the game anyway. That should be the last thing in your mind. But as 1869, far as 1869, we got a Pedro Odell Severino ball, foil for the Baltimore ball. Orioles. Realmuto J D Martinez. Head coach. Look what Kirk Cousins said the other week when he apologized for not getting the ball to his guys who can get into the end zone. He corrected that. They corrected that, and it made a big difference. Yes, many Grandal. That's a nice goal. Right. If you don't know the difference between a handlebar and a Fu Manchu, you shouldn't have one at all. 
But as far as the other thing concerned, I want to quote you when Todd Monson, the new OC. Bob Ryan, not a fan of the handlebar mustache or the Fu Manchu. Football's about big plays, big plays. Now, I know he's not making the calls. Apparently, Freddie's still making the calls. But between the two of them, they Neither have variation. Boy, those look weird. Job. Will it's Smith. Nice Vlad. Got the rookie logo on it. Rookie debut. And another Alonzo rookie. Three or four now. I've lost count. Roll tape. Trying to get some of these TVs in the building turned off because we got too many people talking on TV. About Leaf generally grades very well, Dave. They're pretty easy to spot as far as, like, things wrong with them. So I can take a look-see. Austin Riley. No, not a variation. Still don't have one. Check those last three. I got distracted there. I mean, look, there. I understand the idea of everybody saying, hey, you nope. need to focus. You need to, again, like you're saying, turn off the TV, turn everything off. But to announce that you're asking it because the criticism is out there. Vladdy's update the rookie card right there. Well, one of the big problems in this country, as we all know, is... That is a variation, my friend. Nice one for the Atlanta Braves. Austin Riley, Shannon. Let's see if it's the super rare or the semi-rare. It's the 55, so not the... Not the ultra rare. Nice card, though. And there's our image variation. We got one in every box of updates tonight. By the way... I bet one of those guys was a, a former bear wide receiver. Who and that's our relic. It's going to be Trevor Story for the Rockies. Unnumbered, though. I don't think I don't think he wants us to talking about him on, on this Only show, one rel. Anyway. Darwin's own uh, Hector I, Neris. We got our hit. I mean, I, he gets a lot of got our variation. We got one more stack, and then we got our silver pack. I think Izzy's right. Just keep it in high. And now by our still three, let's roll. Brian Reynolds again. rookie car there. Foil Luis Castillo. Avila, another Alonzo. That's the home run derby variation. Okay, uh, just so not very years. That question will not be addressed until it's time to address. Okay, so at the end of the day, he's on IR. All right, Kyle Allen's our quarterback. Thank and you. that's all he's going to say about Ken. Hampson and Dwight Ron Smith. Do you handle that right, or you want to question his focus? Well, I want to question him saying that wearing that particular T-shirt because I guess that means keep pounding T-shirt. Maybe for the that's right. Another the Keston here, a rookie, and a Nicky Senzo. I've heard Bill Parcell say it. He Iconic cards on the Ozzy Smith. About guys who are not playing. That seemed like a legitimate question. It's a shed long rookie in there too. He had some big games for the M's. Near the end of the season, maybe one of those guys to watch on your draft boards. Kevin Biggio with the 150th stamp. They should know what they're Austin doing. Allen, uh, Edwin I mean, Diaz, and Shelby Miller. Shelby Miller still in the majors. There's a Chavis update. It's a legitimate explanation. Damn, nice call. Gold Pete Alonzo, Ben. That's the nicest Pete on the night, aside from the auto, man. I don't, I don't think he cares at this point, Crowder. I think he built his brand and he knows he's got his fans. So as long as it sells, he doesn't care about the value. It sucks, because when he gets it out a month before, people buy more of it. Nice card, Ben. That's probably a PSA grade candidate. Corners look sharp, rest of the card looks sharp. I'll set that aside. Let me know what you want to do. Take it down a notch. Cease pounding a little bit for a while. Uh, the Razzmatazz. All right, Nicky Lopez, Rock, Trout, Bogarts, right, so and James McCann. Yeah. Israel Gutierrez, Bob Ryan. That's going to be our showdown. In that is pretty, man. Definitely good. Darnell, Will Smith, Blackman, The Good Doctor, and we got a Jake Ordozzi. It's an all-star game, though. Paddock and Glabar. Almost fell. All right, let's see what we got in our silver pack. Garbage there. Paddock rookie. Kerry Wood for the Cubs. That's a cool card. 35th stamp on it. Jeff Bagwell for the Strohs. And Kevin Crone, rookie card for the Diamondbacks. I agree, man. I mean, I'm kind of struggling with the Leaf. I don't know what we should order. We usually put in for 10, 15 cases of each product, but if it's coming out after draft, I just, I, it's a thing. It's a thing to deal with. There's the empty. And you know, the honest fact of it is, Crowder, we burned through that more than anybody else. So, 
if we stopped ordering our quantities and going through what we go through, there would be a lot more of it out on the market, which will keep the price low. I don't think he realizes that we break more leaf than pretty much anybody on earth. Damn, auto right on the top. Chrome Mini, 19 Chrome, Ryan McKenna for the O's. Matt D, streaky ink on the McKenna. Pardino, nice Kyle Wright variation. 20 out of 49, or 499, not a variation, refractor. 20, 499 on the Kyle Wright. Lana Brave, Shannon. Little Acuna. Let's get some color here. Some purple all the way on the bottom. There was an Eloy rookie, Urias rookie. Purple Shim, Brandon McKay for Tampa Bay. Mookie and Rowdy. Week after Bowman Draft, nobody is going to care about it. Shit, when Bowman Draft drops, we break it for like two to three weeks every Wednesday, Thursday. That is not going to fly. Damn. Maybe Bowman Draft will get pushed, Crowder. What are the dates for it? You have them right in front of you, I assume. Owen Miller, second auto for the Padres. And a Tatis rookie right there, too. Ryan J, nice break for your pods. Did we just get through a 19 Bowman Chrome Hobby box? There's another Pete. Without an Alexander Canario. Andres Jimenez at a 150 for the Mets. Ben. Nice card for you, man. Another refractor, too. Alejandro Kirk, 121 out of 499 for the Jays. So December 4th and December 13th. Huh. I could see draft getting pushed to the week before Christmas or the second week in December, maybe. I doubt Leaf Metal Draft will get pushed. Nineteen finest mini. There's the empty. Wednesday the fourth, Friday the thirteenth. Nice. It's either gold, no, it's one of those blue chips. All right, Scherzer and Guzman. We got an Austin Meadows blue chips. Will Myers, finest first Kopech. Duggar and Tukey, performers, Salvi. There's the Acuna blue chips. Man, that's sharp. Such a nice card. Shannon, beauty there. And the auto should be hiding. I do see blue on the bottom. There's a Pete, finest rookie. Ronnie Lamb? Trevor Story Refractor, Soto, Xander, Blue looks like the auto, it is... Israel Gutierrez, Bob Ryan, good luck in showdown. The all-time record... Trevor Story and Jose Barrios. We cannot get away from this guy. He's everywhere tonight. He's following us around. This is the fourth or fifth Corbin Burns auto tonight. What the hell is going on? I did, Brad, yeah. Yep, I have that option sometimes when we're ordering. I am so sick of seeing Corbin Bird. 71 out of 150. This guy better win a Cy Young Award someday. That's the only way he redeems himself. He needs to go 20 and 4 for the Brewers and lead them to the playoffs. Do they do they have him in a box at tops and they just let him out every once in a while? Have a little signature, a little signature session, Corbin. Hey Corbin, we need another 50 cases of Bowman Draft. Can you come do a fifth prospect auto for us? It's insane. It's absolutely insane. I mean, he really is. If you buy the Brewers and Rookie P, you're pretty much getting a Corbin Burns auto every week. It may be from Leaf. It may be from Panini. Who knows? We got blue on the bottom there. That's nice. That's what we're showing down here. Bob, who should be more embarrassed? Bledsoe or Jokic? Oh, oh, let's go completely. Jokic, there was somebody zigged when they should have zagged. We've seen that. It can happen. But F what, Burns. Did I, I just see red? Basketball, literally since 1951. Oh, I have never seen that. I don't have any idea I where his mind was. was. Or maybe you no, didn't. No, he should be thoroughly embarrassed. 
The person who should be embarrassed is whoever Jokic was, uh, Jokic was passing the ball to. I believe it was Will Barton. All right. You saw the one on the top, Ronaldo Hernandez, Tampa Bay Rays. Perdomo just on, fell out, too. Fall League, numbered out of 150 <laughs> for the Rays. Crowder. Ronaldo Hernandez. Oh, my God. Please don't be a Corbin Burns blue. Very nice, Perdomo. Guy getting a lot of uh, a lot of hype for the Diamondbacks. Uh, Zona, Jaron, part of the buyout. That's a nice card, man. That's a grade and stash. And the purple, LA Dodgers, Edwin Uceda. 171 out of 250. Edwin Uceda. <laughs> I bet you did, Brad. I, I would have too, man. I would have too. It's a blue mojo on the bottom. Please, God, no Corbin Burns. Patrick Sandoval, a kid I actually really like. And his autos are dirt cheap. And he's on Trout's team, which they always have a chance every year. Although that hasn't been proven the last couple. They say Sandoval. Middle auto. It's an Oakland A. Jamison Hanna. He chokes up on the bat. Oakland A's. Jaron. And the bottom auto is a blue. Johan Duran. Could also be Juan Duran. 131 out of 150 for the Twinkies. Jaron, little PC for you there. I think I was researching this kid not too long ago. I think I had a nice auto I had to put up. And I'm pretty sure I liked what I saw. Pretty good stats last year. 2.0 ERA, 2018. 10 strikeouts per nine. Nice card. Blue Mojo. And we begin today with a medical evaluation of the supposedly injured Kawhi Leonard, who took last night's nationally televised game off. Damn, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. Don't take my word for it. Listen to Kawhi's coach Doc Rivers, who said, quote, he feels great, but he feels Another red. because of what we've been doing. Didn't mean to peek, but he was out of place, so I'm just going to put him on the bottom. That'll be the card we end the break with. felt better. It's our job to make sure he stays that way, unquote. Second red one of one of the night out of Valiant. Apparently, I picked the good Valiant boxes, anyways. And we got a logo man there. Damn. Nose down. Nose down. I get that one down, too. Oh, it's a nice one, though, buddy. All right. Trinity first. We got Trinity. Cincinnati Reds. Griffin. When Kawhi Leonard is ready to play. And I'm trying to sell ratings on the fact Inscription, that not a Esteban Florio. Second one of those we've seen. And Kevin Durant is out and last two weeks, we hit one last week too. And I had not seen that card before. Nice Florio going to the Yankees, Jaron. Beautiful card. First points, George Valera. You can guess the team. Cleveland, Brian J. Eight pointer. They are the villains. Brian, no points to, for you. Grow and blossoms nonsense. If you run ESPN, can you please give me a raise number one? <laughs> the, the other issue. There is, we go. Go Indians. Ramos, nice card for San Fran. Five out of twenty-five, six pointer. Giants, Brett B. Big points for you, Brett. Into sixteen, tied for third. Currently winning two dollars and fifty cents of store credit. So five out of twenty-five on the Ramos for San Fran. Brett B. Under Armour All America MVP. First patch auto. Jeremiah Jackson for the Angels and Dean. Little four color action. That's nice. Jeremiah. Another one of those top Angel prospects. And we'll go ahead with the 101 Logo Man Inc. to end the Trinity. Jaron, you bought the closeout. You got this team. Jason Schroeder, one of one. You know what the resting policy should, should be, be good for a hundred bucks or so, it's maybe a little more. Yeah. Especially, I thought the idea I think that is just a piece of fuzz no on the inside. On TV. So, I mean, yep, I said this that's all it is. Beautiful card. Schroeder, one on one, logo man out of a Leaf Trinity. Yeah, this is, this is Leaf produced three one of ones tonight. In the game so yeah. All right. so well done, Leaf. Well done. Your Bowman Saturday, boxes need to take a uh, LSU visiting third ranked Alabama. Both teams are eight. Take some advice. Jackson Cower, Kansas City Royals, Steve R.
Two pointer for you, Steve. That bumps you up to 17. And knocks Brett and Matt out of the money. Jackson Cower. 98 out of 99 on the Cower. Osiris Johnson, two points for the Marlins. The Marlins, Chad, 69 out of 99. Man, this is getting crazy at the end here. 16. Three people with 16. 69 out of 99 on the Osiris. Luke and Baker for the Cardinals. Matt D. 5 out of 15 on the Luke and Baker. And that is good for 8 points. Is that Matt D? That is Matt D. Oh, boy. 5 out of 15. Let me just double check if that's 6. Pretty sure 15 is the 8 point threshold. Yes, it is. 8 points for Matt D. 24. Knocking everybody down one. Braulio into third. Dave T holding on to first. We have two cards remaining, and they're both going to score. There's the Baker. The slab is is the Chicago White Sox Brian J. That is not going to alter the board. 87 out of 99 for Brian J. That bumps you up to 10, buddy. Steel Walker, 9-5-10, numbered out of 99. And one of the chase cards in the product. They bring in ratings because when you think Damn you, Brad, and your sharp eyes. Is the first name that comes up. When you Rising right stock, right. and that is a 10 like auto that. for Vlad. Don't see that too often out of Leaf. A lot of his Leaf autos are nines. Vladdy G, one of one for Shannon. Damn, man. What a crazy, crazy run out of Leaf tonight. A couple monster one of ones. Vladdy G, that should be good for a couple hundred bucks. And that is going to score Shannon some massive points. Let's see. Leaf 101, seven points. That is 14. Shannon goes to 26 on the last card. Knocks Braulio out of the money. What a finish. Dave T, you held on by one point, man. That's how you, uh, that's how you join one break and win the points tournament, brother. Well done. So we got Dave, Shannon, and Matt. Dave wins the 40, Shannon wins the 20, Matt D wins the five dollars. I think I'm gonna re uh I think I'm gonna re structure the points tournament and make a uh make a kind of a threshold. So everybody wins points in the top ten. It'll be like two bucks for tenth. Go up and up, like four bucks, six bucks, eight bucks, ten. I think that'll be more fun and more interactive on the board. Do you guys agree with that, or do you like the top three currently? Kind of like the idea of spreading it out more. We can add a few more in too. Vladdy G, one one. Let's take a look at the condition. So we can get you grading advice early on, Shannon. Edges on this are kind of rough, but those can be smoothed out. The surface, very nice, man. Very, very nice. A couple little tiny pecs. That card is a beauty. So, so pretty. I would love to, Crowder. I would absolutely love to. I think he's down in the Dominican sucking down hot dogs and ice cream, though, unfortunately. I really hope the kid takes it seriously and gets in shape. It's not good. Vladdy! All right. Recap on the way. I'll leave myself a note right now, Dave. I remember a million years ago. Dave Thompson Bobby review Leaf one of one hey, for hey, grading. <laughs> and he put earplugs in. Alright. He's got some sleeve and do a few minutes. It looks so bad. And what does the rest of the locker room say about something like that? Well, I'm sure some defensive players say turn the TVs off so Trubisky can see how terrible he is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But what he tried to do, the worst part of this, is he said he was doing this because of the team. Yeah. This is about him. Personally, because there's so much heat directed at him his, personally. His 80 passer rating is 29th in the league, and more people than ever before, people that have scored points right there, are thinking this might be it, but they got to take him out. Not good. Rolling over. Kind of bourbon is it tonight, Brad? All right, Tony, my guy, Carmelo Anthony, gave a rousing locker room. I think I will be having a glass when I get home tonight as well. And what happens? 
Syracuse scores 34 points. Especially since I'm walking home in 24 degrees. Champs, That's my choice, though. Jim Beheim, who usually <laughs> opens up against Colgate, Lemoyne, Binghamton. Ah, he was ducking us. <laughs> he wasn't pleased, saying, quote, you never want to play the elite games early. That's stupid. It's just a money grab. Tony, is he right, or is this just sour grapes? So full disclosure, I go back a long way. He is right. Yeah, I mean, I love him. I do. I, I Funny guy. I... Uh, the gold, Ben. Definitely the gold. That's a good point, Crowder. I didn't think about that, man. Teach that boy how to sign. 34 at home? Well, the rims you practice on? 34 at home and you shoot 13 for 55, which is 23%? That is almost That's how Virginia that's plays, though. They're a good defensive team. They're a smothering defensive team. Yes. They lost three starters from last year's team, if not four. Uh, did they allow eight guys on the court? <laughs> you, you, you can't get that at home, 34. You can't. My, my, my favorite stats, two of them. Last year, Syracuse opened up against Eastern Washington. That's a classic Jim Beheim opening game. Eastern Washington scored 34 points. Last night, Cole Anthony, the son of Greg yeah, Anthony in North Carolina, he scored 34. How are you only scoring? I get that, like you said, I get that Virginia is one of the best defensive teams in the country, even with the guys that they lost. I think people might view that Cuse Virginia game a little bit differently once they get into the season and see how dominant their defense always is. No, I don't blame them. But yeah, 34 points is terrible, but like they said, it was against the number one defense in the country for the most part. When I first saw it, I thought, oh, Syracuse, Big East. I've still not made the connection that Syracuse know, has gone to the I ACC. Know. I don't think you can open up, even if you're at home like Syracuse, I don't think it's fair to Virginia or Syracuse that your first game of the year is is a league game like this. I'm not sure that that's fair. And I know that Bayheim would rather play his first, te first 15 games at home against Colgate and Cornell and Binghamton and things like that, and then maybe go to the Garden for one game and yeah. go back to home. Okay, last recap of the night. We'll be logging off after this. The Alonzo was a numbered goal. Yeah, it's numbered out of 2019. I'll show it, show it again in a second here. Alright guys, recap for 425. There's our points tournament final. Dave T held on tonight. Strong, strong charge by Shannon at the end. Matt D took third. Trevor Story, game used, or event used from the All-Star game. Our non-auto scoring cards. We had a Reese Hoskins that was out of 60 for the Phillies. Bumgarner for the Giants out of 99. Rendon out of 50 for the Nationals. Longoria for the Giants out of 99. Really nice Cole Tucker update card for you, Chad. That's a nice card. Hopefully he uh, explodes next year. That's out of 67. Nice one. And an Alonzo Gold rookie debut. That's the one I said, Ben. I would PSA that. That is a positive, absolutely. Absolutely, man. All right, here's our Leaf Autos. We had a Steel Walker for the slab, 9-5-10. And big boy in this break, the Rising Stock Vlad Red Valiant, one of one. Beautiful card. Shannon, congrats on that. Let me know if you want to grade that, Shannon. Luke and Baker, that was out of... 35 for the or out of 15 for the Cardinals Johnson for the Marlins out of 99 Cower for the Royals out of 99 really nice one-on-one -on -one again out of Leaf Trinity Schroeder logo man for the Strohs Jackson for the Angels Ramos for the Giants Indians Valera Yankees Florial and that was another Jonathan India auto on the night for the Cincinnati Reds Griffin all you man got yourself an India and all the other Chrome autos Danny Jansen for the Jays, Kopeck for the White Sox, Scott for the Marlins, Gold, Eric Jenkins, Lucas Herbert, Ramon Laureano, Jeff McNeil, Jeffrey Springs, Nick Schufo, Francisco Arcia, we had a nice gore auto for the Padres, Hilliard, Corbin Burns, unfriggin' believable, McKenna, <laughs> Owen Miller, Corbin Burns, <laughs> Ronaldo Hernandez, Geraldo Perdomo, Edwin Uceta, Patrick Sandoval, Jamison Hanna, last two cards, Johan Duran, nice blue mega for the Twins, nice card for you, Jaron, and really nice Alec Baum, that was a variation numbered out of 99, those sell pretty well as well, Braulio, that was all yours, man, let me know if you want to grade that, or just have it shipped out, that is 425, again, I thank you all for joining, pretty enjoyable night, big Otani in the first break, the rest of the night kind of spread out, evened out.
Nothing, uh, nothing too huge out of there. Alright, dudes. I will be in the store tomorrow. If you guys need anything, just let me know. Ronnie will be on tomorrow night. He's got a busy week. Hockey and football. Big new release for uh, Hockey Upper Deck Series 1. Chase those young guns. Craig, Ben, Brad, Dave, Jaron, anybody else in the room? Richard, if you're still listening, sorry I skunked you, bro. Rough night for the Cubbies. Next time. Safe travels, everybody. I will see you guys uh, next week. Have a great weekend. Later, everybody.